With the popularity of the Mega Skirt with the O3 Cobra crowd, uh, due to the plug and play version being released, I thought I'd show you a nice companion gauge I made. It's powered by a Raspberry Pi and connects right to the, uh, the Mega Squirt through Bluetooth. Uh, I just turned the key on, you can see it's booting up. It's totally automated. You turn the key on, it comes on, turn the key off, and it goes off. You don't have to intervene, flick switches, or do anything. Um, it just it just comes right up, and we'll have our gauges load here in a second. Also related here, this traction off is actually now a traction on with Mega Squirt. I push the button, and you notice it's green instead of orange, like the factory traction control. It turns on traction control, which unlike the stock ECU is a real traction control that actually works. And there we go, it's connected to the car. You can see I got, on the right hand side there's dual wide bands, coolant, oil temp. Um, this is a true flex fuel car, so right now it's on 93 pump gas with Torco, so you can see the ethanol content over on the left hand side. In a cooler tank, intake air, and then I got a boost vacuum gauge on the right. Obviously you can customize that to however you like. Related to this traction control here, I also have a dial sitting in the console here where I can adjust the gain based on the surface I'm driving on for how aggressive the traction uh, control needs to activate. Obviously you set it up in the laptop first, but that gives you the uh, some, some adjustment while you're driving. I also connected it over to my headlights, so now if I turn the headlights on at night, the unit will sense that, pick it up, and it dims the screen. I know it doesn't look like much on the, on the camera, but it's darkened down for nighttime driving, and then when I turn the headlights off, it uh, senses that, comes back to brightness for daytime, much like you'd expect from OEM. Uh, you turn the key off when you're done driving, and it senses that. It takes the, uh, the software offline, the Tuna Studio, it, it closes the software um, cleanly first, and uh, at that point it'll, it'll just power down the unit and cut off. You've stepped out of the car by now probably, and walk away, and it's, it's off. And that's it.